Until recently, a trip into space was reserved for an elite few, astronauts and a handful of mega-rich adventurers. Now the United States Air Force and the Florida Space Authority have signed the first and only agreement for a private company to use Cape Canaveral as a launch pad to take tourists into space. We are pleased to have the agreements with the Air Force and the Florida Space Authority to use this historic site. Aero Corporation's Alteris spacecraft, which will begin service next year, will provide would-be space tourists with their first opportunity to earn their astronaut wings by traveling more than 80 miles above the Earth. The Alteris spacecraft is based on proven technology used in previous manned space exploration, and according to ERA, it will be the safest spacecraft ever launched. We are going to make space exploration very safe, but just like a roller coaster, there will be certain minimum physical requirements. Aero Corporation, founded by aerospace veterans, is one of a small number of companies to privatize out of this world travel. Aero has yet to announce its fare schedule, but tickets may cost in the range of a pricey sports car or a more typical earthbound adventure. Space tourism is like any new industry. As it becomes more available, the price will drop. Look how expensive cell phones were. Now they almost give them away. It's just a matter of time and technology. A time is drawing closer when average people will enjoy a trip like no other, far above the Earth using safe and dependable technology under development today.